Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of It's Jenkins. This episode of It's Jenkins is brought to you by Duralast QS. Build your mech to last with Duralast. Okay, so we're taking our main lance down today, so let's have a quick look. Um, hmm. Yeah, I know what mission we're going to take. Let's just do this straight up. I'm, I'm not going to bother going into anything. Let's just take you, escort in the desert. I think we're going to take this one. It's two and a half skulls. It's against the uh, the Marians, so we should have an opportunity for a lot of quick sell stuff. Two and a half skulls, I think we're pretty good there. If we're only facing one lance at a time, we should be fine. I'm going to go max salvage on this. Hopefully we can get a uh, um, trebuchet part or something along that line. But we'll see. Now, this is a desert environment, so I think we're going to go... Let's flush these guys out. Let's bring the second lance in. Uh, Road Rash, number three. Vengeance, number one. Number one. Venom, we got running... Ah, oh, man. Gotta remember. Uh, Cloudbuster, right? Where are you here? And then we've got Vision. Where are we? What are you running again? Stormcrow, right. Oh, no. You Wait, you're not. You were running... We put you in the Centurion, didn't we? Talos. Right, you were running the Stormcrow's backup. Um, and then we were using Boomer in the Centurion. Now, he's not perfect for that role, but... You don't really have anybody else. He's got to learn anyway, so... All right, well, let's hope things work out. And then we got old Ironsides here. You were running the Pegasus last time. I wonder if we want to go with the Strike Pegasus. It did well on the last mission, but I think if we want to... I think we want to run the fire truck in this one. As strange as it sounds, I think really the fire truck is the way to go for this. Because if we want salvage, that's the way to go. Ooh, we're at one and a half skulls too. Uh, yeah, we're good. Let's go. How bad could it really be? Yeah, yeah. Command interface initiated. Okay. Ah, weren't we just here? This was the This was the. Uh, My God. Yeah. What a hole. Oh, they've got uh, guys at the drop site. Okay. They're a pretty wide berth around that drop site, too. Uh, hmm. We want to get some fire suppression on these guys. Oh, they're like... Maybe they've got more than one lance. Oh, that's going to be nasty if there's more than one lance at the start. I think they do. I think they have more than one lance. Uh, what can I do here? I gotta decide, try and d divide their forces here, so... Let's try and start on this side. the vehicles back a little bit what we'll try and do is break them up into groups I mean it could be one lance spread out but chances are it's not it's more than one okay uh, who would I rather move first probably you fuck? let's get into here no shooting Running. Get some sensors on there. Yeah, they might just be spread out. Hellspawn. Centurion A. Yeah, they are. Answer. What's the per LRM? Oh. That's not good. So we got to kill this guy as fast as we can. He's just outside my range. Why is it giving me range for... My LRMs when I can't. Oh, I can. Uh, I'm gonna fire a chaff at this guy. I can't have him landing that first shot with those thunderbolts. 
Hopefully there are only tens, but still, it's a lot of damage. Um. God, you got no movement. Let's go this way. Maybe we can gang up on this Hellspawn and murder him real quick. There's somebody else probably back over here. What are your orders, Skipper? All right, old Ironsides, how far can you get? Do I want to send... Where do I want to send you? Let's go back here. Roger, Skipper. Taking it. It's going to be a couple turns before we're in battle anyway, but I would rather have you back further as opposed to up closer. In case that Thunderbolt decides the fire truck is a viable target. Here he comes. Ow. Systems holding. You need to go this way though, because we gotta kill that vehicle. He's gotta go away. I know it's only a four pack, but still. If we can kill him before he launches the last one. Yeah, you're running. I have no idea what you're shooting. Oh wow, minefields, because of course you are. I'm here. All right, well, painful as that is, they're incendiaries. Okay. Let's just crank these up a little bit. All right, we're going to be warm. I tried to spread out as best I could. What are you firing? Orders. Can we get away from a lot of these mines? Not really, eh? Like if we go here. No, here. Hello. Apparently you don't want to do the shift click now? Not giving me my waypoints. Oh man. Hmm. No, let's push. So my thought was I'd back up and shoot from a distance, but he, they're going to keep dropping. He's going to keep dropping shit on us. Skipper. Uh, yeah. All right, well, that's nine. A little less. So what do we got? We got LK and what else? Uh, right, EMP and incendiary. Wow, we don't even have a... Really? Don't waste them. Receiving you. Okay, um... They've still got a wild card somewhere. Let's just push down here. Let's see what they do. We've got to divide up our forces. We can't be in the same area. If he's going to lay a thick minefields like that. Alright, let's get up here. All right, let's move. We've got to get you into a position where we can get some firepower down on the enemy. All right, you're done. Hey, yo. All right, old Ironsides, how far can you get? Into the trees. 
They can see you there, though, but they can't see you here. Stand I mean, they can move over and shoot me, but that puts them more in the open, which is better for us. Mines? Nope. Inferno. All right. You need me to hold still for you? That was the scent, wasn't it? I don't think he moved. Commander? Moving out. Yeah, we're gonna put. I think that guy's gonna fire the thunderbolts at him again. Receiving you. Fuck, you're in a bad spot, buddy. Let's just eat the thunder. Hopefully, aye, aye. he's that's all he's got. We'll find out here in a second. Oh man. Okay. So that was the Hellspawn firing the Infernos. So you got Swarm. Try aiming next time. See what you get. Yes, Commander. Well, we got somebody back here. Light mortar carrier. So maybe it wasn't the Hellspawn firing. It was the mortar carrier. On my way. Double time. So if we're going to drop chaff, I mean, he's too far away. Let's drop it on this guy because maybe he hasn't gone yet. So what has he got? Chem lasers. Large vehicle flavor. LRM-30 pirate. Let's drop some chaff on his ass. All right, a little bit. I mean, I think it's only like a minus one to hit or whatever it is, but still it's better than nothing. Why you would shoot at the, at the most difficult target to hit? I don't know. He's in the mineral field. Why would you... I don't even... Okay. Sure. I'm not going to complain. But, I mean, maybe they finally saw that rack on that thing and they're like, Oh, shit. <laughs> we probably got to shoot that guy. Ah, fuck you. So that's Inferno. Or, uh, what's it called? Minimal damage on that hit. Not Inferno, but uh, you know what I mean. Standing by. Hydra. Okay, I don't think we can push to target those guys, though. We'll be too open for attack. We could do this, though. I'm going to come down here. Affirmative. That's going to give us some evasion. Make us harder to hit. And still let us attack. We're not going to have the best chance to hit, but... We'll take, oh, that's actually not bad. Um, a little weaker on the SRM. But that's fine. We're going to fire everything. Hopefully we can get some hits here. In all uh, large miss with the tag hit, so that's good. That'll help a little bit. Who's up now? Wow, they were really spread out. Okay. Ready for orders. Should be able to Roger. catch this guy in a moment here. He may not have shot at us because he may be. Uh, what's the chance for the thunderbolt on these other guys? Oh, it's not. They're not in uh, our arc here. We may be too close for these Thunderbolt packs to really shoot these vehicles, or my Storm Crow in the vehicle, so... Well, he is backing up. Okay, nice. Confirmed. Let's get you out of the fire, buddy. Uh, let's not go there, though. Let's go over here. I got you. It's one of those very few matches that I've actually been able to spread my units out. What are your orders, Skipper? Ooh, we're not quite there yet. Um Yeah. Double time, let's go. And then sixteen on the scent, that's not bad. Eighteen on this guy. A 
Let's go with... Uh, he's, he's, this guy's going to be running so cool, though. I was going to say, let's go with some Inferno, put the put fire under him, but he's got chem lasers, so it's... The LRM-30 is the hottest thing, and I don't even... I think that's only like 25 heat or something, so it's... Let's just shoot him with the LK. Affirmative. Got a few hits in on him. Strip a little bit of armor off that guy. This Centurion 9A won't have a lot of armor, I don't think. Well, that's an interesting move. Standing by. So that's up the hill. I want a shot this turn, so let's get up here. Moving we'll take a shot at that guy. Yeah, that's not bad. We'll take that. Oh, nice hits. All on one side, too. That's so rare. Here comes the mortars. Go out to fire a truck. Good. Standing by. All right, buddy. Can we get the guns into play? We cannot. Because you're so fucking slow. Get up here. Acknowledge. We should be able to push in next turn and get some uh, shots off. Commander. They've been trying to stick to an indirect fight. Let's get up here. Got it. No shooting, just running. We should. Um, I think there's a bit of a hill here, right? Yeah, a little bit of one. Yeah, we'll fire everything on this guy. Target confirmed. Structure exposed. Nice. Ready to rock. Orders? No, I don't want you yet. Um, we go before all of these guys except for him. Do I want to punish this Hellbringer? Like we could. I'm going to punish this Hellbringer. We all go before the Hellbringer, so we're going to go after this guy. Let's just see if we can pull him. Or this, well, the Centurion. Yeah, it doesn't have that great of armor. This guy's got a lot more. Medium chems. What is the Hellbringer? What does this guy have again? An AC-10. We have a better chance to hit this guy, so let's do it. Oh, yeah. Okay, pilot Up injured. Up. Gonna push these guys. Oh, shit, I went to the capture zone. That's not good. I didn't even think when I clicked. Well, that'll make things interesting. Eh, uh, you know what? It wouldn't be me if I didn't do something stupid like that. 27 heat. Alright, not too bad. Inflicted some Got a chem laser. Hellspawn's what, 65? Or is it a 50? It's a 45. Why do I keep thinking it's a 65? It's the Hellbringer I'm thinking, right? That's The Hellbringer's the, the, the 65 ton forward. clan mech, right? Am I right? Probably right. Maybe not. Okay, we can't get a shot with this guy though. But we'll see if we can uh, kill that uh, mortar carrier, though. Yeah, probably not, huh? Oh, uh, we'll take the pot shot, though. You never know. Close. Negative damage. You can smell the uh, gunpowder going by as he was uh, as he was sitting there. Still going after him, huh? Oh, you got a back shot, so that's why he got the hits. Huh, 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 huh. Let's get in the trees. It makes us worse chance to hit, but if they shoot back at me, then... Uh... Oh... 
I'm feeling stupid. I'm feeling real stupid. Let's hit him. Here we go. <laughs> oh, see ya. <laughs> bye bye. Oh God. Oh, I'm so glad I'm not on the receiving of the end of that now. That was so painful before. All right, we're gonna move here. We'll take a shot at that uh, vehicle. I'm not gonna move the Cloudbuster down from here to chase that. I think the Stormcrow can probably get this guy, unless we can kill him here. Copy that, Commander. All right, we landed a good shot. Probably hit the other side. No, we got the back. All right. He hasn't used his mind dispenser yet, which is a bonus. Yeah, you run. Oh, maybe not. All right. Damage minimal. Well, this could be bad. They're ready to move. Well, we're not ready to move out yet. Shit. And our initiative tanked a little bit. Oh, no, it didn't. I was going to say it tanked a bit, but I was only looking at Boomer. Boomer's like the low skill guy at the moment. Who do they got going first? 12, 12, 11. Oh, it's my turn. No, not the vehicles. Uh. Oh, shit, right, they get reinforcements. Oh, yeah, right. Fuck. Really? Clan ERPPC, huh? Well, this just went from friggin' zero to a thousand in like two seconds. I was gonna say, good thing it's only an urban mech, but... They still got firepower. Alright, we do need to kill these guys. Uh... Let's go here. And then we can swing back around next turn. Let's hopefully get the kill here. Oh, I don't want to use the Thunderbolt just yet. Maybe I should... You know what? I'm going to drop the Mind Dispenser there too, just in case we don't get the kill. Okay, we got it. It's fine. I'm afraid to put it in the other direction because it'll just be in our way. I'm out of SRM. Okay, we can turn this now. We're up to, what do we got? The Pack Hunter is one with the PPC, Urban Mech, Urban Knight, and they're going through all the mines. Thank you, I really appreciate you laying those mines over there. It's really helpful. Tell you what, we're gonna send the fire truck against the, uh, against the mortar carrier. Um, Yes. What's up, diggity dog? Because if we get the kill on this, we get the AC-10 surviving on the other side. It's kind of really the best salvage off this guy. Uh, let's hit him. Roger that. Okay, good damage. Good to go. Okay, let's get to here. Get into a little bit of cover. At least the second wave isn't so bad. Roger that. Firing on target. Yeah, I wasn't even thinking when I Waiting moved that. Orders. I was just looking at tiles, like where, where I was standing. And I'm like, yeah, we can just go right there. That'll work. Too far from the center. Let's go here. At least the vehicles seem to have some half decent weaponry. Scent will be gone this turn, I think. Uh, standard ammo. Firing everything I've got. Yep, there he goes. Ammo explosion, probably. Should have run when you had the chance. Okay. What can I do for you? You can get out of the line of fire with your two medium lasers and some machine guns. Got it. Nothing. I hear ya. Alright, you took a side hit. Large Pulse, SRM-6 Valiant. Okay, move over to here. Don't need to tell me twice. I know we're in the open, but... I think we're fine. Here we go! Nothing. 
All right. Uh, I may need some more time in the simulator. Orders? Don't think the simulator is the issue. Okay, Talos is going to go up here. What are we in range with the rockets, eh? I mean, we could go with tandem burst on him and hope we kill him. What's he got for internals? 20, eh? I might need these later. Let's go with these two. Hopefully we get a hit here. Copy that. Oh, we did. Nice shot. I'm out of SRMs. 61 damage. In the side. Skipper. Your job, should you choose to accept right, it. Full speed. No target. I mean, you don't really have a choice. Because I am controlling your every action, and we'll hammer this guy. Nice. Did he bail out or did that blow up? I need a new target. Said destroyed, so we probably blew up. Yes, Commander. Alright, now you can't get around that way, so we're gonna have to get you Oh, back down the hill. Yeah, that was a bad move Commander. going up there. I thought I was gonna have time. Like, I thought I was going to be able to clear out the first lance and then get into position, but... Alright, we're a little bit out of position, but not too much. What are your orders, Skipper? Uh, I need you to hold off for a turn, because we got to drop some recoil here. Drop some heat. Let's park right there for a second. That ah, give you a little bit better initiative. Let's reserve the vehicles. See what these guys do. Probably the pack hunter going first. Nope. R62, huh? What's this guy back here? Another urban mech? Oh, the R60. That's the uh, um, AC20, isn't it? Ready for orders. All right, you need to drop some heat too. Let's get around this way. Full speed. No target. Waiting on you, Commander. Um, let's reserve. I don't mind if your initiative tanks. Here's the thing. I could brace, but then I lose my evasion from the turn before. I'd rather keep the evasion, and then if I was going to brace, brace Instead, after they go. I'm, barely scratched. I'm technically giving them a free shot at me, but they're going to get a shot off anyway. And I would rather have them not hit than hit and do a little le less damage. You know what I mean? I'm just giving them, like with the evasion gone, I'm giving them an extra free 10% chance to hit, I guess. That's my thought here. Now we got to follow these flares, right? I can't go around this way, unfortunately. Which is fine, but I mean... That's the guy that's got to die. He's going through the fire over there too, which means he could be really heating himself up. All right, fire support Talos. Let's get the acid to the top. And yeah. We hit him with a couple, I think. Yeah. It's a good thing they're MRMs because they're harder to shoot down. Now I want to see if I can get the rack 2 on that pack hunter. I'd love to have that clan ER PPC, but I, I, he's got to go because that's a lot of damage. 75. So that's a melee mech. I'm receiving you. And he's starting to overheat. I think that pack knight or the uh, pack hunter was coming over to meet this guy. Maybe we're gonna go full speed, get like five chevrons of evasion if we can. Yeah, we're almost in battle here. Oh, we only got four. Okay. Good to go. You're out of position. Let's get back into the game over here. Direct line of sight. We'll take a shot down there. The thing I like about the Stormcrow now is we hit those long-range weapons on it, which is uh, really helping out. Um, uh, yeah. 
Did they both hit or just one? Looks like they both hit. Confirmed. By the numbers, it looks like they both hit, but I don't think they did. Uh. Huh. I don't know what our chance to hit is. Pretty good on this guy, so if we can't hit that pack hunter, Affirmative, Commander. we'll uh, shred the urban mech. Okay. How much armor do you have? 320. Well, not for long. I'll leave this off. We still have one more round of mechs to come. And let's go with... Uh, I'm going to go with EMP on this guy. Because we're not going to kill him, I don't think. I mean, we might. But if he gets a shot off, this will super... Well, let's, let's try for the kill. Let's just do it. Yeah, the AMS got most of them. Reporting. Critical hit. Oof. Alright, he's not looking so hot. What can I do for you? I don't know, I think maybe uh you guys can start moving, I think, because that pack hunter is like not too much of a threat. Get over here. Uh-huh. Let's just shoot this guy. Maybe we could get those um, those AMSs to jam. Hey, stay in the crosshair. If we keep let him, I keep shooting them. Hopefully they'll jam, you, and then uh, that'll open it up for next turn for us to Got fire it. stuff at them. Two points. I hear ya. Putting up some big numbers. Go here. On my way. Not too too worried about these guys. They have some half decent armor. They can still be killed, but he's got a laser AMS too. I don't see his heat going Good to up. Go. Put you in here. Okay, that's pretty good. couple hits with the uh, pulse laser. He still hasn't jammed. Sorry, I just... My son, when he was a kid, used to love fire trucks, and he would hear one. Like, this is when he's like two or three. Like, like, like around two or so. Two or three. We're in the park, and he would hear a fire truck. And then... He would just be like, and he would run right to wherever the fire truck was. He'd be mimicking the uh, the sound of the uh, sirens. It's the cutest thing in the world, but it's like, whenever I now, whenever I see a fire truck or hear the word fire truck, that's the first thing that comes to my head is that sound. Got it. And then the parents in the park would just look up and look because they would be wondering what what kid is making this noise. Uh, not very good. Mediocre. A little better on this guy. Let's take the shot here. The SRMs will get shot down, I know, but I'm going to fire them anyway. Uh, maybe not. I've got a head hit, too. He's taking some punishment back there, that guy. The pack hunter's going to go. Boomer's going on 13. I don't think the rotary's jammed, and I'm going to pull out of combat for another turn. Yeah, he's coming back into play. Going after the vehicles. That's a big number. So hopefully we can get that. Hopefully it drops. So that's on the left, no, right shoulder. So if we take out his left side, oof. Whoa! Easy on the armor, buddy. I know, right? Waiting on you, Commander. I don't know if I really want to close this much with this urban mech. 
I don't know if he was going to melee or not. I really don't. I don't. I don't know if you'll see it as an option. Let's see if we can get some crits on this guy. Commencing alpha strike. Yeah, critical hit. What can I do for you? Let's see. That's a little closer. Let's get into here. Don't need to tell me twice. Let's see how this Urban Mac deals with the, uh... Ooh, maybe we can get a kill here. I know I want to save that PPC, but... I don't want him firing either. Okay, he's in crit. Hit like that and you're toast. He's gonna be barbecuing. Ready to rock. I want to burn this Urban Mac? 10%, huh? 61, 67. That's flames on the way, though. Uh, is there no way we can get around the damn flames? And get a back strike? I guess not, huh? Alright, screw these guys. This fire truck, man. I swear to God. If you, if you had said to me, like, in the last series, oh, you're going to be using a fire truck consistently for a long time in the next series, I'd be like, you're an idiot. Why would I use a fire truck? But damn, this thing. Fun time. See if we can get him to bail. Come on. That hits. Yes. Good job. Waiting for orders. That worked out better than I expected. Okay, your front's there. Ooh. Oh yeah, the mines are over here. Damn. Are we going around him? We are. Okay, perfect. We just skirted right the edge of him. Perfect. Back shot. Here it comes. Okay, apparently not. Alright, just a few herbies left, but... They can still do some damage. They got some peeps. They got a melee mech. Got a big gun on this guy. Is it this the, tw is this the 20 version? Still, the I think it is, because the armor is only 480. So he's got to go... Yeah, you know who the threat is. Waiting for orders. Butt cheeks are pinching. That's what's happening. It's not my vehicle. I don't mind shooting over it. <laughs> as long as we don't destroy it. I don't think we will. We should hit this guy. There we go. Yeah, I landed everything. Reporting critical hit. We may want to put the uh, optics thing on this guy. On the move. Mech is on fire. So's the pilot because he's so hot. Uh, the MRMs probably land a few anyway. I don't know who's the threat though. We could take this guy's arm. Let's try that. We can get rid of that AC. Waiting for orders. Le sergeant. Affirmative. Avancement. I don't know the word for enemy in French, unfortunately. Right, commander. It's probably something like British, or like <laughs> the word for British in French Mech is enemy. Destroyed. I hear ya. Um. I know um's not really a word, but I'm using it. My wife keeps telling me it's a it's a uh, what do you call it? It's like a word that you like a pause word or whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called. Anyway, let's go over here. I gotta shut that rack off though. We're gonna shoot this guy with everything but the rack. We're gonna hold on to the thunderbolt though. Uh, yeah, let's hammer with these. Oh, his AMS is out of ammo. Okay, we got him. Oh, he's at an AC-10. All right, still. Tango is trash, Skipper. It's the melee boy Thank left. You, Commander. Too far, huh? Just get up here. At least we're able to advance, you know, and we're not uh, 
gonna have to wait to get out of the uh, circle here. He's going on 22, let's see what he does. Hope he doesn't melee. Oh shit he is. Is he? Oh, he doesn't have the speed. Yes, Commander. You know what he does have though? He's got some big guns up his ass, that's what he's got. Um, yeah, the pirate's a little, a little close, but we're gonna fire it anyway because we got lots of ammo. I get lost on enemy spirit. Talos is a little underwhelming, I find. You gotta do something yes, about Commander. that. Get up here. What have you been doing? I copy. Besides, actually, this mech's been doing a pretty good job. Okay. Got to go. You. I gotta keep. I gotta keep these guys relatively turned towards him. I know he's only got a handful of rockets and stuff, Waiting but for I don't want to expose my back armor if I can avoid it. I read you, Commander. Moving out. I got no indirect here with the vehicles, so good to go. I'll just sprint them over here. Double time. They're poised to all go out next turn, so that's good. I just have no idea that's where the enemy right. is going to show up. Yeah. All right. Three in the back, hopefully. All right. That should do it. Nope. Come on, bail out. Scar's a critical hit. Nope, I'm bailing out. What are your orders, Skipper? Well, my orders are you to. Oh, you can't finish the guy off. You're not. Well, you are fast enough, but I don't want you driving through the mines. So let's just uh, reposition. I got you. Reposition. We don't want to lose you. Receiving you. And we can switch to chaff. Maybe get lucky with the chaff shot? We got seven shots at it. Might be able to just, uh... Nah, not enough of a crit. Rear armor it is. Nothing. Negative damage. Repeat, negative damage. Skipper. That's a big boomer. I'm there. So, um, we got lots of ammo. Let's use it. I got you. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, this gun. <laughs> Enemy elimination. <laughs> oh, that's brutal. All right, we're going out this turn, so let's move up. I have no idea where the enemy is going to spawn. It could be Position here, confirmed. or it could be over there. Oh, shit. I just braced the Centurion. Damn it. I thought I was moving and bracing. Confirmed. That's all right. You cover the Centurion's back here. Okay, let's get you somewhere where you can strike. And then we're moving the vehicles out. Get to there. There. Got the second one moved. Hold this position, Commander. The package will be on its way soon. I hear ya. Three. Uh-huh. And yeah, come on. Waiting on you, Commander. Oh, it looks like they might some have, have they may have some hefty stuff there. All right, well, drop ships in. We got to keep these guys alive for one turn. I mean, I guess the benefit to landing where we did is they kind of put mines where the enemy is going to be going through too. Rotunda scout car. This is another centurion though. What's this guy? Really hoping for some quick sell in this. Ostrock. That's the. Is that the 60 tenor? Or is that the Ostol? Oh, heavy rotary rifle. Good. We can get actually get some uh, ammo off that guy, hopefully. Good to go. Yeah, you can't even turn. That is kind That's of a bummer. Cooling. But they can't now, actually do anything. Orders. I mean, it makes sense, but we got to kill that rotary rifle. So let's do that. 
I can't have that thing shooting. That's garbage chances to hit, but we're gonna throw the Thunderbolt on because if we get lucky. That's got a lot of armor too, eh? Firing. Oh, we did hit with it too. Oh, nice. Those are some good hits. What's up, boss? Maybe it'll make him think twice. Okay, Talos. Going full throttle. We were saving the tandems. Let's use them. Not the best chance to hit, but this guy's got to go away. It's a pain in my ass. Locking on target. Maybe it'll make him run a run. I'm out of short range missiles. Confirmed. That's your certain death there. Let's just get to here for now. Copy that, Commander. They'll just all shoot at this guy if I move that close. Let's try this guy here. Ooh, 60 with a heavy flamer. Yes, Commander. Can you get a shot at that, uh... Rotary Wrecker? He's probably going to fire at you, too, so let's, uh... There's a good line there. Let's take that one. Double time. Let's go. I think we. I think we're just in range with the machine guns. We are. Let's hope for a hit here. Targeting for an alpha strike. Waiting for orders. Yeah, I can't even turn these guys, which is kind of sucky. At least they'll survive. Ready for I hope. You have to give that rotary wrecker. Oh man. I don't want to line my guys up here. Let's move into here. I think I'm going to hit him with chaff because I don't think we're going to kill him. So we'll use the chaff to at least lower his chance to hit. Hopefully, we get one of those on. Roger. Tags on again. No chap though. Uh, yep. All right, buddy. Well, if if I, at any point in time I need you to do something, it's like right now. It's a little better. Let's get into here. Ten, I need you to shred. Can you shred for me? Um. Incendiaries. Let's expend the last Thunderbolt. Hope we get a hit here. Thunderbolt hit. Not enough for a kill though. But still pretty good damage. My LRMs are out. I'm shocked that those Thunderbolts hit at low percentage chances. But you know what it is? It's just that it, they hit really well. Just to uh, make me think I have a glimmer of hope of actually killing this thing, and now it's going to ruin somebody. It's going to ruin somebody's day. Yeah, he's going after the uh, convoy. Commander? He's not being shot at. Got it. All right. Well, hopefully we get good initiative next or next turn. Yeah. H three. What does that have? Ultra. Ultra ten. A lot of rockets. Is that rockets or miss or LRMs? Yikes. That hit hard. I think that's rockets. He's like hot too. Yeah, all rockets. Ultra 10 and rockets. That's an interesting mix. Good job. Objective secure. Well, the Centurion wanted to be invited to the barbecue, so let's uh, show him how well we can cook. Alrighty. So they're going first, huh? Because of course they are. Wait, they shouldn't be. Who's going first? Oh, the scout car. Right. They got some half decent firepower, though. I'm sh I'm shocked the rotary wrecker didn't fire up my guys, though. Like I'm I'm really shocked. I I wonder if it was trying to get a shot off at the vehicles, but just couldn't get there. And then just gave up rather than shooting somebody just for the sake of it. Or maybe it's programmed not to take really low percentage chance to hit. 
And maybe that's what it had. Alright, um... Fuck the map up again. Okay, let's get over here. Roger. I want to see what our chance on that rotary is from here. That's pretty good. We're going to take that shot, see if we can get the kill here. We can free up everybody over there then. Yeah, nice. Okay, good. Didn't say ammo explosion, so... If we can, yeah, I want the ammo. Receiving you. I want the ammo. Okay, I'm going to pull back here with the storm crow. We're going to try and kill this scout car so I don't have to... Sacrifice someone to go after this guy again. Ah, fuck's sake. Really? So far away. Alright, let's hope we, hopefully we land something here. Nothing. Reporting. Negative damage. It's alright. You you hit when it counted. Ready to rock. You softened up that rotary wrecker, that's for sure. Um No, just a move. Right to there. Roger that, Commander. Uh, yeah, he wanted to be invited to the barbecue, so let's uh, show him what we're cooking. Target locked. Enemy six, Skipper. Only two hits? Really? We're cooking Praetorian is what we're cooking. Commander. Uh, can we get... Oh, we can. Full speed. All right. Target. Got a shot at somebody here. Ostrock. Might as well burn the tandems on him. Okay, a little bit of acid on him. Some pens, but not much. I'm out of SRM. That's all right. I'm here. Location confirmed. Let's try and kill this scout car. I got a feeling this guy's making a run for it. If he does, I'm not, I don't feel like chasing him down. If he makes a run for it, I'll send the cloud. I'll stick the cloud buster on him. He probably will. There's got to be something on the maps that are like the vehicles seem to be attracted to for some reason. Yeah. What are you doing, buddy? You're about the only fighting mech that they've got currently. All right, sh shooting a fully armored guy. Good stuff. Lots of armor. That's all right. Confirmed. Okay, let's see if we can get the vehicle. We gotta turn off the uh, the rotary for now. Uh, we'll leave the incendiary. Well, yeah. Well, what's the LK? 18. We'll throw that on. Hopefully, we can get some hits here. Stand still, dummy. All right, a little bit of damage. Sure. Ironside's on 15. Uh, this guy goes on 16. Yeah, it was a good. It was a good choice bringing that uh, that fire truck. I can't get over how far that thing moves though. With a good pilot in there, that's crazy. Because I think you got. I think they've got a piloting of five or six, which gives me plus 25 or plus 30 movement, and then I get plus one hex for the vehicle skill, in guts. So it's like, or plus one move. I, I don't. I think I don't know what that equates to in hexes. He's okay. I'm gonna hit the sixth cloud buster on him. I guess. Took a bit of damage over there. What's up, boss? Hmm. Position. Do I want Ostrock parts? I don't think so. Firing a full salvo. Oof. Somebody's got no back armor. Target eliminated. That was a lot quicker than I'm I expected. And hopefully this will be two. Roger Skipper. Kicking in. Nope. 
take this. Oh, never mind. Take it back. See, every, I don't know why I opened my mouth. It's like always the opposite of what I what I what I say. Can we get the? Uh... All right. Well, we can't shoot, but we'll come down here. Drop some heat. I better not shoot the pirate AC on him, though. What are your orders, Skipper? Ooh, let's just get you down over here too. I could try for a headshot with the LRMs. Let's go that, and then let's switch this to EMP so it does really le like almost no damage, and then see if we can play a headshot here. I'm on it's gonna make his heat sinking ridiculous anyway. Yeah, like. <laughs> Ready for orders. Just walk up to him and look at him. <laughs> just stare in his cockpit when he's getting overheated. Just like ask him how long he wants to put up with it. Skipper. Just drive right in front of him. So just look right at him when you're burning up. <laughs> it's just so bad. Oh, I'll put the machine guns on too. Hopefully we can get a hit and hit. Let's crank him to six. Hey, what's up? All whip. Go. How you feeling in there? <laughs> Oops. Shit, sorry. <laughs> this is so good. Mission successful. I'm just, I was laughing the whole time for, for to, go, to come to this point to load back in because I just picture the Centurion pilots like st he's like frozen. He watches the rest of his units get killed and he's standing there shut down trying to get things restarted. And then the fire truck slowly drives in front of him and looks at him. Like a kid with a fire hose, and <laughs> he's like looking at him, and you know he's gonna squirt him with it. But you're like, no, don't do it, don't do it. And the kid's got this big smile on his face, and he just lets, <laughs> just hits him with the flamers. Oh man, brutal. I didn't think he was gonna die though. I wonder how many kills the fire truck got. It got uh, one ejection and one kill. We got three kills in the scent though. That's actually pretty good. And Boomer here, we got that's the uh, rotaries damaged, but we'll get that fixed. Good thing it's got lots of hit points. And uh, we're going to crank Boomer's gunnery skill up too. So we can drop some recoil, hopefully. Man, that's just brutal. Okay, we got to see what we got down here. Um, rotary wrecker is 55 tons. Now, how many parts do we have? Do we have wrecker parts? We don't. It's unfortunate. AMS Mark II, though. Clan ERPPC. There's the heavy rotary rifle, which we do have one. How much ammo is down here? That's the question, because we don't have much. Here we go. So we got two tons of this and two tons of that. It's six rounds per ton. So I think we need both of these if we're going to get the rotaries going. So that would be five of each. So that's 60 rounds. So really we can only... Well, I was going to say, we can only run one rotary... But if you have two of them, I mean, you're not going to need the, the 10 turns, the 60 rounds will go if you're firing them both in one turn. Piloting support is interesting. Clan double heatsink kit. Meh. We're not, like like I said with the last mission, we're not really going to find clan heatsinks all that much. Clan endo, though, that's nice. Interval four packs. Two of them. You weigh four tons. It's actually not bad, but I prefer the bolt-on thunderbolts if we're going to use them. Mine dispenser. We're out of the mine dispensers at this point. Let's grab you. I think we definitely want one of these guys. And maybe the ERPPC. That opens up some potential builds for this lance and for the other lance. Uh... Yeah, there's other stuff that would be good, but I think if we're going to make a build on that avatar, the double, double rotary rifle would be a good way to go. So we got a centurion part, so we've got two centurion parts now. Two Hetzer parts. I wonder if we can get our Hetzer up and running. Light carrier, okay, so what else do we get down here? Regular laser AMS, two medium chem lasers, we'll hold on to those. we got the Thunderbolt packs. Armor can go for 390 Jesus. Hot seat cockpit we'll hold on to because we're going to... Wait, do we have one of these already? 
We do. We'll hold on to one as a backup. Compact heat, heat sinks. We're not going to use a compact. We got some, though. Do I want it? Uh, let's just hold on to them. Patchwork materials is good stuff. Basic sensors can go. That can go. That can go. AMS ammo we definitely need. And SRM ammo I think we can trash. So that... I'm sh We didn't get any quick sell parts, but we did get the rotary stuff, which makes me really, really happy. All right, before we go... I'm interested to see now, because I wasn't expecting to pick up that second rotary rifle. I, I thought it was going to get destroyed. But with two of them, to the grease pit, Commander. this avatar, we're going to have to change the name to, like, Destructor or something like that. I don't know, because if, if we put a pair of rotary rifles on this thing... Oh, man. I don't know. Uh... Heavy rotary, heavy rotary. We need a double heatsink kit for sure. I can't change anything in here. So let's go to the ammo for a second. So if we go, I'm just going to throw this in just really quickly to see. Oh, it's got to go in the actual arms with the weapon, right? So if we don't go full out, let's say we just put 24 rounds for each. Because if we're shooting four rounds with each, that'll keep the recoil low. Then that gives us six turns of rotary rifle fire for each rotary rifle. What kind? I mean, we ha yeah we have to have a double heat sink kit in here. There's no way we can't not have it. And I think we have to go with some ferro. So if the explosion does happen, uh, it doesn't destroy the mech completely. Cause that's a lot of damage from those uh, from those things. So the client exchanger probably, f maybe. That's the quick sell prototype double heat sink kit. I'm just gonna toss it in for now. That'll do it. It's almost a waste of a prototype double heat sink kit, but ultralight gyro though. So you need to be careful. Now, do we have? Uh, anything to stabilize these things with. We do have the battle... Com we need, uh, uh, do I have a... I may have to pull a targeting computer out. Ah, that has to go in. Then maybe we take the exchanger out. Well, I don't know. Leave it there for now. Range finder is a possibility. I mean, probably that, because we get the gunnery with it too. Uh, this might be nice. Not enough free slots in the head because we got a dedicated laser AMS. That's why. Um, how are we doing for heat now? Oh, we got to still have the exchanger in there though. Okay. Fire control system headshot. Just throw that in there. We need backup weapons though with this thing. We'll need to definitely max out the arm armor. I don't know. I'm going to play around with it between episodes. Um, we need recoil compensators, though. And we had two in the last episode, and we never got them. Because I took the other stuff. So, yeah, we need upper recoil compensators. We don't have any battle computers. I know I have one in the... In, I think it's in the, If we're replacing the Centurion, though, with this thing... Hmm. I should be replacing the uh, Talos. This is going to be great when we get a uh, when we can build the um, double AC2 build. At least I hope we can build a double AC2 build. Yeah, because I mean, if I if I bring the targeting computer into here, then I can put this and this in. Then we'll have a free slot here for something else. You know? Is there... We don't have hands. But that... <laughs> that would be priceless as well. Uh, yeah, I'll have to take a look around and figure out what else we would put in here. 
I mean, we could put bolt on rockets in, I guess, but. We definitely probably, I mean, we definitely want to tag somewhere. Probably put, drop it in the CT. Yeah, I got to figure out what else we'd do with this. Yeah, see with the exchanger gone. Now, I don't think it's going to let me put in the recoil. Like, this thing is... Recoil of three per shot above two. So at four, it's six recoil. 5% jam chance per shot mitigated by gunnery. Like, these things are... <laughs> if we have a great pilot... These things are going to be brutal. But maybe that's what we do is we wait till we get a better pilot. And do a different build on this one. You know what? I'll let you guys decide. Let me know what you want me to do. Oh, we got the double AC-20. Do we have regular AC-20 ammo? But that's a ridiculous amount of... Uh, we do have some, but not much. Like, that's... The recoil on those is ridiculous too, right? Where is it here? Yeah, eight per we <laughs> per weapon. We're going to have to get legs for the legs in this thing here. I mean, we could do a plasma cannon build too and put two plasma cannons in this thing, right? But I, I want to, I don't know. I think I want to see how this goes. But 341,000 is not really, and one day to get it up and running. We're not done building it though. All right, I'm going to play around with it between... You know what? I'm going to leave it for now. Let me know what you guys think. Do you want to see the rotary rifle build? Do you want to see the plasma cannon build? I don't think we can do the the uh, double ace, the double 20s because we don't have the ammo for it. Uh, that's a lot of ammo is required for that thing. Or we could do just a straight-up energy build like ER PPC, LBX PP, or a pair of heavy PPCs. 720 range. Recoil it too. Like, I'm better off with the ERPPC. It's same damage, 840 range, and recoil a 1. So we could go... Alright, th I'm going to be stupid here. Just for a second here. Let's, uh... Where's the strip equipment? Right there. I'm going to be stupid here, just for a second. Put you in there. And we put you here. And we put you here. And uh, we do, uh, we're going to need extra weight for all the fucking heat sinks we're going to have. We'll definitely have to have like that there to help out and that on this side. Wait, it won't work. Why? What did it just say? Warning something or other. A laser. Oh, these aren't considered lasers, right? Okay. Fair enough. I'm sure everyone was screaming at me for that one, too. That's fine. I can take it. Okay, that goes in. I know we were building this stuff for... Oh, this is barely anything. <laughs> this is just, like, nothing. Oh, we're getting, like, almost one bar per. We just hope, have to hope we don't lose any prototype double heat sinks. Then we would get the targeting computer in there. With the battle computer heat, which I don't have the targeting computer for, but that would drop weapons heat by 10% even more. So the output would be 81. Then the recoil, reduce the recoil. And then what? Well, we would probably take that off because we don't need it. We could go with... Well, we definitely want that in there. See, this to me, as, you know, strange as it is, this to me is a better build than the rotary build. I mean, the rotary is going to give you a lot of instability, but this is continuous firepower, right? Three times seven. Well, maybe not, because the Sabo is going to do 50% more damage to armor. So that's still, pro the rotary is still probably a better build. Then we could maybe put some ac active camouflage on this thing. We need countermeasures, though. Give me a guard dog. Yeah, QS guard dog. It's got to be QS, right? You guys know. I don't even need to tell you. Active camouflage. 
requires signature stealth what am I missing here one slot per, lo per location except head and center torso ECM or EW to be installed which we have regular stealth armor works so why is this not what am I missing well it's, you know what that's going to increase weapons heat anyway this one won't will it 5% as opposed to 10 when it's active and then I got to remember to turn it on and off too that's like detrimental for me how many times do I just forget to turn shit on all right, say it in unison all the time. Uh, let's go with that. Can't use the AR-12, unfortunately. That would be really nice in there. But fire control system. Right, it would have to be the it would be the the contraband one that we have. That's in this Centurion. So let me know what you think, because I mean we do have a couple of options. I don't. I mean we could do like a regular AC20 build with the AC20 uh, Mirdrin. That's going to be kind of a boring build though, because it would probably just be that. I mean we got the Silver Bullet Goss as well. We could go with the AC20 and the Silver Bullet Goss as a third option. So plasma cannons, rotaries, ER heavy PPC. And then maybe you know, like the like the um, the the Midran twenty and the uh, Silver Bullet Goss. That's a scatter shot one. We had the PPC one, the Rotary build, and what was the last one? You know, I just said it. Oh yeah, the plasma cannon build for overheating. I think overheating has been. Well, we haven't used these before. We haven't used these at all yet, right? The, the area effect plasma weapons and that could be rounded off with like a the ERPPC as well well let me know what you think in the comment section down below I'm, I'm going to hold off building this thing until you guys let me know what you want me to do with it and then we'll try something I got a feeling it's going to be the rotary rifle build but please feel free you know whatever comments I'll go with I'll go with the most number of like somebody comment well I'll, I'll try to set up a poll or something maybe yeah I'll try and do a poll I think and we'll get some votes and see what happens. All right, but I'm going to end this episode here, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe and go check out that Quicksell site. And until next time, we'll see you later.